one word, vodka. You know what? I'm obsessed with this look. Ooh, I mean, oh, it smells sweet. Hello, sunshine, and welcome to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Monica, and for today, you want something exciting? I'm reviewing uh, this PR, this collection that I received uh, a few weeks ago. This is the Kylie Cosmetics and Chris Jenner collection. I mean, look at this baby. The packaging is so beautiful. So I am reviewing this collection, and I am creating this eyeshadow look and give you guys a tutorial on how I create it. I'm showing you guys swatches giving you prices just being honest and give you guys my honest opinion so if you guys want to see that make sure you keep on watching look what i have here i'm so excited i mean look at this pr packaging you guys i mean every package is more beautiful than the other every time they come up with something like the packaging always amazes me they have really nice pr packaging and like the package of the products as well so let's open this baby up Ooh, she's beautiful. I mean, this is one of the most beautiful like PR packages that I've seen Kylie do. This is really nice. And they have something underneath, but I'm going to show you guys what they have here first. So here we have the eyeshadow palette. Here are the eye patches. Here are the lip crayons. Here is like the dual powder blush and highlighter. And then here we have the lip serum. This is what underneath i mean that's such a nice cocktail set i cannot wait to use this even though i don't drink that much but yeah but let's get into what's really important the makeup so i'm gonna take everything out of here and start showing you guys everything okay so first let's open up the eyeshadow palette i love the packaging the packaging is really big but the eyeshadow palette is only this like little triangle here I like the olives, the glass, the team is really, really nice. And with the crease signature and glitter is really, really beautiful. Here we have the name of the eyeshadows. Let me just tell you a few. Cocktail O'Clock, Shake Not Starred, Dirty Martini, Two Olives, Car Jenner, Can You Hold, uh, Walkie Talkie, Drunken Monkey, One Word. Vodka. Names that they come up for the eyeshadows, like the shades, really nice. This is the palette, it's so cute. Open this baby up. Ooh, she's pretty. Well, the eyeshadow palette retails for $30. It comes with 12 highly pigmented shades inspired by Chris Signature Smoky Eye. This martini design palette features smooth, easy to blend formulas in warm and cool tones. So it says that it includes some smooth mattes, multi dimensional metallics, and glittery shimmers. I think it's like standard Kylie Cosmetics price. And this is like a collection with Chris. And then this is the uh, powder and blush highlighter cheek duo love the packaging i love her clothes here with the roses the red and like white roses blonde hair and the sunglasses the shade names are it's five o'clock somewhere and money doesn't grow on trees love the nude on the packaging uh, she always has pink but i like that this time they have like nude with the roses really nice oh those are big pants they're She's pretty. I like the highlighter a lot and the blush shade is just like perfect. It's beautiful. I think we have the lip crayon set and it has these like roses as well, just like the PR box and her signature. And this looks like, like a package of cigarettes or something, but I love, love this package. I think I'm gonna keep it and like store things in there. I don't know what, I don't smoke, but I just like this. It has three crayons in there lip crayons i love, love the packaging the nude color is so nice those are very like mainstream kind of shades shades that everybody uses next we have the eye patches i cannot for the life of me read what is here i've tried i don't know if it's cure timey queen tiny i love the picture of her with the sunglasses and then the eye patches underneath like she's taking care of herself even when she's out the little diamond touch really nice let's see it has the olives that's such a nice detail i love it the packaging is really cute so this comes with let's see six six eye patches i love the packaging with the olives it's just so cute i love the olive cocktail martini team it's just so so crease and then we have the lip serum this packaging is so cute it's see-through it has the olives which is beautiful with her signature. Oh, it smells sweet. 
It smells really sweet. First thing I'm gonna dive into is the eyeshadow palette. And before I start with the whole look, I'm gonna show you guys swatches. So I'm gonna swatch some of the shades. We're gonna start with Dirty Martini. Oh, that's pretty. Then we have Shaken Not Stirred. And then we have Nover Mouth. It's a beautiful icy color. Then I'm gonna swatch No Car Jenner. That's a beautiful color as well. It's like a peachy kind of tone. I'm gonna start swatching the matte ones. I'm gonna start with Cocktail O'Clock. Then I'm gonna swatch two olives. That's two olives. Then I'm gonna swatch walkie talkie. And this one right here is Can You Hold, which is this like mauve pinkish kind of shade. The shimmers are really pigmented. The matte ones, I really needed to go twice uh, with the swatch to get a bit more pigmentation. While I'm going to do my eye look, I'm gonna put these uh, eye patches on. And I think I figured out the name. I think this is like Cure Teeny like the martini like cure teeny i think i think that's that's what they meant with it I, it took me a while okay it took me a while but i think that's what they mean with it it's like inspired the martini but like curse your eyes or something well, yeah i think i think that's what they mean they have like olives on them that's so cute pop them on they are big they are bigger than your usual like eye patches like eye masks and stuff they are dripped in product. And I'm also going to apply the lip serum. So this is the Make It Dirty uh, lip serum. Let me see how much it costs. I'm gonna give you guys prices. So the palette, I already told you, was $30. Lip serum is 22. Let me tell you a bit more about it. So this is a lip serum. Uh, you can use it as prep before lipstick or alone for a shiny pout is a limited edition it's clear non-sticky and it gives you both comfort and care for the lips let me see if they write here what's the name of those eye patches because i'm so curious where is it yes they are the curtini under eye patches it was hard to read on that font okay <laughs> curtini so i was right it took me it took me a while to figure it out so these cost 24 $24 and these are for those days where your under eyes need a little extra love you can pop these limited edition as well cure teeny under eye patches and you're good as new I'm going to go into the lip serum I love the smell people who can get a bit you know with the smells this one is a bit strong I don't think it's light as they say it is it's not that light. I have no problem with that. I have no problem with smells, but a lot of people might. So the first thing I'm gonna do is go into Cocktail O'Clock, which is this beautiful orangey, warm tone kind of shade. It's using like a normal fluffy blending brush. And I'm gonna tap this shade into my crease. So right away, I packed in a bit of color and is really pigmented. You guys can see that the orange is really, really bright. So I liked that. And those were the shades that didn't like swatch like right away. I had to go twice, swatch twice to get a bit of pigmentation on my arm. But the eye base has a lot to say in this. Wearing an eye base underneath really helps bringing that pigmentation. I'll start blending it out using circular motions. I'm gonna go again with more of that cocktail o'clock, pack it in a bit more color to deepen up the look. I'm gonna use a blending brush like this and I'm gonna blend that shade out into my brow bone. This is like a flesh kind of shade, so it's perfect for that. So I'm gonna use a smaller, a bit smaller, like blending brush like these. And I'm gonna go into Hay Matte, which is like this darker brownish kind of shade and darken up the crease. And I'm gonna use a small pointy brush with a bit of um, Cocktail O'Clock to blend the two shades together. So far, so good. Everything is blending really well together. I'm really happy with the color payoff. Can't complain. Now it's time for me to cut the crease. First go in with Cocktail O'Clock, just right outside here. 
dropped and I'm using a, another uh, fluffy brush like this and I'm gonna go into two olives which is that beautiful olive shade with a very tiny flat little brush like this I'm gonna go into shaken not stirred this one right here and try to create a line here I don't know how's that gonna go but I'm gonna try And I mixed in some of Novermont. And then I'm gonna mix a bit of Proud Mama in One Word Vodka and just place that where I have the rest of the eye base. I'm gonna just like blend this out. Now I'm gonna go on top of two olives with a bit of Dirty Martini and bring some like more shimmer into the look. And this is such a beautiful color. Up right there. Oh, that's pretty. The patches have dried out. I'm gonna just remove them. Or no, I had them. I had them on the wrong way. <laughs> but yeah, I did my base, finished the eye, pop on the lashes, and I am obsessed with how the skin and the base is looking. I dove into some Kylie Cosmetic products since we are like doing a review on her palette and just like chose some of my favorites from the brand. And I'm happy that I did because the base it's giving. I have cream blush, but I want to go with this on top. So this is the powder blush and highlighter Chic Duo. It's 29 for the two shades. I think it's a good price because the pens are actually like quite big. So let's go with a little bit. Give a little smile. That's so pretty. Actually, very pigmented. I think I went with way too much on this side so I'm gonna fix it. I think it's pretty and I think it complements the eye look actually. I want a bit of glow in this look, just a bit. Hmm. Okay, there it comes. It didn't come on the first swipe but it is here now and it's a gold kind of shade with some pinks in it. Put it on this side too. Great job with this duo. I actually really like it. I think it's my favorite thing that I've tried until now. It's time to finish the eyes and I'm going to apply with a very small brush. I'm going to apply the green on my waterline. Not under, but like right on my waterline first. Under my waterline, I'm going to go into Hey Matte. And then I'm going to blend that with Proud Mama. So these are the lip crayons. She came out with three different shades. $32 for the set. Three new shades of their smooth velvet soft formula. They're highly pigmented and comfortable. And it says here that it's much resistant. Oh, that's pretty. It's like a red with a orange undertone. This is classic crease. So this is a more and more of nude. This is like orangey, reddish shade, and this is a more pinkish tone. So lips are lined. Let's go with, what's the name again? Classic Crease. Oh, that feels so good on lips, so velvety. Love this combo. But you know what? I think I'm gonna go with a bit of that red right in the center. Just like dipping. Okay, that's a beautiful lip, like a lip combo. That's a beautiful lip combo. I love the touch of the red in the middle. Gives a little color, adds a little something. I actually really, really like it. And you know what? I'm obsessed with this look. Okay, time for my final thoughts on this collection. So, Chris collection. I like it. Like it, like it. I am happy. I am not amazed by the eyeshadow palette. I like it, but it's not something that I am wowed about. One thing that I really, really liked is the blush and highlighter duo. I think that's my favorite thing from this whole collection. I like the price. Like, I think that for the size of the pants, they're quite big. It's a great price and I love the color. I love the color of the blush and I am obsessed with this, like, highlighter color. I usually go for, like, more icy champagne tones, but I really like this gold. I think it really fits me and it looks really nice in this eye look. I really like the serum. The packaging is absolutely gorgeous. I'm gonna use it every day. 
love the serum. The lip crayons are a big yay for me. I'm not usually into lip crayons, but this one felt really great on the lips and the little combo. It's really, really cute. And the eye patches, the Cure Teeny. They were great having on while doing the look, even though I had one like in the wrong direction or whatever. And this look, I am so happy about that. I love, love, love this color. I love this color combo on the eyes. I'm actually obsessed with this eye look. I love the glitter line. I love the red on the lips that goes well with the blush. The highlighter, like the gold tone of the highlighter, I'm really happy with that. So that's pretty much it for the review, you guys. I had so much fun filming this video. I had so much fun like reviewing this collection. I love reviewing stuff. So I had a lot of fun. I really hope you guys enjoyed the review and you guys liked how I gave you guys the tutorial, showed you swatches and stuff. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, give the video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, because I would love to have you on my little YouTube fam and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my future videos. If you're still here, Thank you and I love you and uh, that's pretty much it. I think I've said everything and I really hope to see you on my next one. Bye-bye.